Hello, everybody, and welcome to the Seven Deadly Sins Tournament Arc. It's not tournament what it's arc. Called. Tournament arc. Everyone loves tournament arcs. It's episode Everyone se loves episode tournament seventeen arc. of season two. Is what it is. Yeah. Yeah. It everybody is. loves tournament arcs, and this is a bizarre tournament arc. Yeah. But we'll get into that though. It's a tournament cause... arc that shouldn't even be happening. <laughs> no, but it. I'm I'm happy it's happening. Yeah, but like but I said, we'll, everybody we'll loves. Get, everyone arc. loves a bit of tournament arc. But um, yeah, we'll get into what makes it kind of interesting in a little bit. We'll start at the beginning though, dude. Because every story must start at the beginning. Was that foreshadowing? Or was it like five or six shadowing? That was foreshadowing. Oh, okay, it's foreshadowing, dude. So um, yeah. So all our main characters and a couple of side characters. Yeah, it's all make the, it to the center of the it, maze. It's all the main characters plus extras. Plus extras, yeah, the stunt doubles. Yeah, they were gonna be main characters, but they no, they weren't. Nah, they didn't quite make. They didn't make the cut. They weren't prime enough. But uh, yeah, <laughs> then then it cuts the intro. I always I you... watch it every time because every time I notice something different. Okay. I think Melio Meliodas has grown. You know, he's what like taller. I think he's taller because <laughs> back in like the beginning half of the season. Not only was Elizabeth crouching, but like his head was the perfect chest height. But now it's about half a foot higher because his full head is now above. Can I just ask? So I think he's what, grown. Can I ask why you're paying attention to this? <laughs> I don't know. I just noticed it. But I think he's grown. Okay, so he's either grown or it's an inconsistency in the drawing. Well, no, because even when, even in the. Because it happens more than once, so it can't, like, you know, okay. sort of sort of one off. Okay. But, um, you know. Sure. I, I'm, just gonna, I'm just gonna say sure. With power, like his, comes about half a foot of growth. Right. We'll, we'll just we'll just do that. Okay. So, yeah, then <laughs> then uh, yeah. they're introducing the Ten Commandments, or two mm. of the Two Commandments. The uh, Two Commandments. It really annoys me, by the way, how they refer to them as, like, they're the Ten Commandments. I'm like, well, no, there's two of them. Yeah, yeah. This is when I wrote another thing. I was like, "Are they now called the Eight Commandments? Because two of them are dead." Like, well, one of them's not even a com commandment. So are they the Seven Commandments plus one. <laughs> the Seven Commandments plus fill in. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I that really rolls off the tongue. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's probably why they. So yeah, they're like, it, mm. they're like, like here, everyone's here. Let's just wipe out everyone else still in the maze. Yeah, just kill everyone that's not in the middle. Yeah. yeah. Then at this point, like the giants, Deanne and the other one, Matrona, are like, "Oh shit, that's Droll, the giant god." That's, that's the giant god. He's yeah. the first giant. Yeah, but it's that, bit, also that... known as Machamp. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is actually Mega Machamp. This is what it looks like. <laughs> Mega this Machamp. Yeah, he's a fighting rock type. Yeah, but he's not the only surprise. No, I was not expecting this. Yeah, the other one, this was... whose name I did not write down because I don't give a fuck. I did. Oh, what was it? I mean, I wrote down her other name. I think it's not the same her name, right? Deadly yeah. Sin name. No, Ten Commandment name. Ten Commandment name. So she, she's, she's one a fairy, yep. but it doesn't finish there. She is the first fairy king. Also, is it, it a she or he? Is she a he? That's what I, I was going to ask. Because I was like, that's all. I, I was like, yeah. she's remarkably flat for a she. Yeah, and also they didn't cover it either, which would yeah. make the show into an etchy, but it's not an etchy, so I guess it's a dude. I guess it's a dude too, but it looks like a fucking... Yeah. All of my notes say she. So. Pe people say Gotha <laughs> looks like a girl, like, th that's a boy. Yeah, like, I, it's definitely a boy, because they say First Fairy King, Yeah. so... I, I, I want to look it up, but I, I want to look it up, but at the same time, there's absolutely going to be spoilers on her page. It'll be like, lol, she's dead. Or something. It's yeah. It's, her name is Gloxinia. Gloxinia. <laughs> yeah. So they're like, the okay, here's the rules. Here are the rules. It's two v two. Two v two. And then Gotha does a front flip. Yeah. And completely wrecks. He just uh, lands on Escanor. Escanor. Who yeah. then gets stabbed. Oh my! Yeah, yeah. The yeah. giant get, plant. I was like, he oh. gets wrecked. I was just like, oh my god! Did they just kill off Escanor? Yeah, I, I I was like, oh my, they didn't I, even give him a chance. I was like, surely they wouldn't. Yeah. Like, Just, oh, but yeah, then then um, Gloxinia is like, you know what, I'll, I'll just show some of my power. She's like, I've got a show I can actually give them anything. Yeah. So she revives him. And he, he revives him with some dew. She, he. It's... He. It's a he. It's a he? Mm. Wow. 
So we've been fooled for 17 episodes. Yeah. It's oh, definitely you, though. Fuck, it's a tra- I said she was hot last episode, I think. <laughs> oh, you got God. duped, mate. I, got, I always get trapped. I'm terrible. My trap. You got freaking trapped, dude. My trap sense is awful. Happens, what happens in Steins Gate, happens in this, <laughs> happens in Danganronpa, happens in... Ah! <laughs> it's a, it's getting to be a real issue. Yeah, man. <laughs> I, should, I, I should just assume that l- chicks don't exist. Mm. Yeah, they don't exist. Everyone's a dude. Yeah. Everyone's a dude, really. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, then I put, oh my god, these teams are amazing. Oh, yeah, yeah, I, I listed off quite a few of them. Yeah, I, so, yeah I read it's, a few it's, <laughs> it's Barn and Meliodas paired together. Best Seems team. a bit rigged. Uh, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, that does seem a bit rigged. <laughs> and then, uh, I couldn't, I, I couldn't make this up. Escanor and Hawk. Escanor and Hawk made me laugh. <laughs> I was like, Hawk's like, good thing, Hawk. Hawk's like, good thing yeah. you're paired up with me, old man. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, and awesome. then there's Elizabeth and Elaine. Elizabeth and Elaine are awesome. They're like Yeah, I think the those are the only three I got. Because we'll, those are the three that matter. Uh, there's King and Deanne. Oh, yeah, King and Deanne. And uh, then there's... Um, Gotha and Jericho. Yep. They had a funny interaction. She was like, aren't you with my best friend? And he's like, I got dumped. <laughs> he's like... Uh, I'm like, yeah, don't tell her the full story. <laughs> Probably a yeah. good idea. Like, yeah. uh, Hendrickson is with uh, Baby Grimo. Yeah, so we confirmed now that Grimoire is still Grimoire's a child. Still a baby. Uh, and then he, when he, when he, when he, he shows him, he just goes like, Are "You can involve children in this." Yeah, you savages. And then like, you um, savages. I think Gotha's just not Gotha. Uh, Hauser is just with a random. Mm. Uh, oh, and then um, Gil Thunder is with the Gil the Thunder is guy. with the ice dude. Yeah, that guy who showed up last episode. Yeah. And then Arthur's with oh. some other. Dude, I, I've gonna lie, not gonna lie. I've had a little thing spoiled for me, and okay. it's that mage guy's name, and it's the most unoriginal. Like I went, no, that's not real. Okay. Apparently, his name is Gil Frost. Gil Frost. So you got Gil Thunder and then Gil Frost. Okay. If that's Why real, not? I think that's real. And if it's real, that's just, that's just terrible. Yeah, that's a bit s- stupid. Yeah. Oh, who's with the dog? I think Matrona was with the dog, right? Uh, yes. Yeah, Matrona's yeah. with the dog. I think we got everyone. Everyone important, anyway. Yeah. There's also some randoms, and they're like, we'll make golems to fight. <gasps> oh, mate, do not Google. Do not Google, um, <laughs> Gil Frost. Is there massive spoilers? Yes. Dude, I told you not to Google. <laughs> I thought a simple Google, just to find out if that was the actual name, would be fine. Don't do it. Is that, uh, Freaking, um, warning. Spoiler warning. Okay. Everyone, don't look up Gil Frost. Don't look it up unless you've seen the whole series, I guess. <laughs> or read. If you've read the manga. I mean, I've read the manga. Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. But, um. <laughs> Elaine and Elizabeth have some female bonding. I put. Yeah. They, I bet they've met for five minutes and they're besties. Pretty much. Yeah. Like, um. I forgot Elaine was, like, really powerful. I, like, completely forgot. I was like, oh, what are they. How are they gonna win? Yeah, but don't worry. Elaine's super OP. Yeah. So, you know, that's, that's cool. She's and the maiden of the forest. You know what they're like? You know in TF2 where you've got the heavy and the medic? Yeah. That's them. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Just without the, the Russian and the, the crazy. Yeah. Someone, like, dub over this scene with Elaine and Elizabeth, but with the, like... Uh, the TF2 characters. Yeah, just with the lines from the heavy and the medic. <laughs> yeah. That would be pretty That'd funny. That would be funny. That would be funny. But uh, yeah, then so they win their fight pretty easily. Yeah. And then Ban and Meliodas are like, "See, I knew they could win." Yeah. They're like, "We're so proud of our whammy." We're, we're so f- I love how they were literally. Oh no, that comes next. But they're literally fighting over who's best girl. Yeah. They're having a waifu <laughs> war right there. I put I put Ban and Meliodas accidentally win. Yeah. Like this was fun. They're this having, a, they're having an argument. They're fighting each other, but somehow win. They're fighting each other, and the their enemies, which are just some <laughs> low-level demon birds. Demon birds. They're just getting in the way. Like as they go to punch, one of them, the bird will just fly into the fist. Yeah, I just loved it when he, the the bird demon bird like flies and just cuts off Barn's arm, and he's just like he's looking all smug, and then he's just he just like someone just took your arm, Barn, and he's like, don't change the subject. <laughs> don't change the subject. <laughs> and like while they're arguing, 
uh, Elizabeth and Elaine, like, what the fuck they're arguing about? Mm. Yeah, and then um, <laughs> when one tries to take off Meliodas's head, he, he ends up taking off the thing's leg. Yeah, it's just. And then Bahan does the same thing with Meliodas did, and Meliodas is just like, "Don't you change this, son?" <laughs> it's, it's good. It's like it, it is good. It's good. <laughs> uh, but, God, yeah. it was quality. It, it was probably the most Seven Deadly Sins it's been in a while. Like the most. Yeah. Like, the interactions between Barn and, Barn and Meliodas. I don't, and didn't realise how much I value their interactions until they, yeah. until now. Until they were gone and now they're back. Yeah. And then yeah. My, my next note is, oh no, King's bleeding. Yeah, but he wasn't bleeding from injury. <laughs> no. This is an no. anime, so you should know why he was bleeding. This was so funny. So, <laughs> so uh, Deanne's decided, because she's not got a memory, she's like, well this petty human boy can't fight, even though he's flying. Yeah. So, um, yeah, put... she slots him in between her... Boobs. Yeah. Bajongas for safekeeping. Yeah. And King's just like, boobies. <laughs> King's like a 12-year-old. He is. But, um, I loved this, though, when he he, they, he he goes to make a confession, and then Deanne just ruins it. Yeah, she's like, I have a confession too. Your stuffed bear is broken. They're fighting yeah. the, like, golems, by the way. Yeah, the golems. Um, and one of the golems is um, the, the, bee, the beehive it's chick. It's like the, the beehive chick that has ruined chick. everything. Yeah. I, she, I can't believe she's still alive. I really wanted her to die. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, she, she's a character, but who would care if she died, really? Someone's yeah, gonna guess. be like, "No, she's best girl." I'll be like, "Fuck off, is she best girl?" <laughs> like, get out of it. Beehive chick was my favorite. <laughs> get out of it, Jericho, best girl. Uh, <laughs> yeah, fight me. Uh, Let's not get into it right I'm trying now. To think, I'm trying to think who I don't know who my favorite is. To be honest, I'll give you thinking time for waifu wars. Yeah, it's fine. It's but, fine. Um, get, I, um, this is like uh, King goes Super Saiyan. No, no. I was like before that. I put uh, Elaine jumps in front of Rockman and gets hit in the head again. <laughs> yeah. This yeah, season yeah. is just. I want a compilation from this season of just uh, not Elaine, Deanne. Sorry. Yeah, yeah. Deanne, just Deanne gets hit in the head every time it happens this season. I want like a compilation. You could probably make it a couple minutes long. Oh yeah, yeah. Which is good for a compilation of such a you know random thing. And then yeah. she's about to die because it's, uh, they're like, get him through the heart, get her through the heart. And yeah. King, King's like, with the, by the power of the seven Dragon Balls. I will go super. It's over 9,000. Yeah. Um, he's, he's like, true spirit spear. And then Fairy King, lady boy, is like, ah, spirit cure. Spirit uh, cure? Spirit spear. Let's see what he can really do. He's like, ah, he must be a fairy king. <laughs> he must be that fairy king, the new one. Yeah. That new ones. Oh, kids these days. Yeah. Back in my day, we were like whamming. And we had wings. Yeah. So how much you want to bet King? Wings? How much you want to bet King grows his wings? Just very One soon. One next episode. Yeah, like very soon. He's he's evolving into a butterfree. Yeah, he's just a petty metapod at the moment. Yeah, he's a freaking. All he can do is harden. Ha ha ha! Sex joke. Yeah. Um. But that yeah. was where the episode ended. He went Super Saiyan, and then it was like... And then, it, then I was just like, it had to end there. Yeah, I was like, oh, come on. Really? Come on. Come on. What, what are you doing, man? What, what are you doing? So I'm like, the thing I'm, I'm not sure I like as much is that they've split the Ten Commandments up, and we're never going to get our big fight with all of them versus all of them. No, that's um, Seven Deadly Infinity War. <laughs> Don't talk about that. <laughs> seven Deadly... Um, Survival. Uh, uh, I, I don't know. What, I don't know. This is the stupid. I don't know what you're talking it's about. Just, I'm trying to go with all the kind of popular things. What's survival? I don't even know what that is. Like, is in, is in like a survival games. Ah, <laughs> survival games aren't popular anymore. It's like battle royale. Battle royale. Seven, seven deadly battle royale. Seven deadly, for, seven deadly Fortnite. Seven deadly Fortnite. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> if you if you find the uh, the sword, you turn into Meliodas. Yeah. But anyway, that was that was this week's episode. Uh, it was. We're, we're just chatting. About, we get to the point where we chat about absolute bollocks. Yeah, that's true. But yeah, <laughs> next week, King. 
He's gonna do a King, cool thing. Kick some ass. Yeah, and then hopefully he gets some ass. Get some ass. Yeah. yeah. Don't That's know how that would work because he's like a midget and she's. But she can go midget. Yeah, but she's literally a giant. Yeah, but she can go midget though. Yeah, well, Merlin doesn't have a body to prepare the potion anymore. Yeah, but she doesn't need to because she can just like make a hologram body. Okay. I'm sure well, it works. How's Escanor gonna fuck that? Well, she'll get her body back eventually. You don't just grow another body. Well, I don't know. She's not like a lizard that grows its tail back. You don't grow your body back. If she grows her body back, I'm gonna be mad. By the way, um, <laughs> like a little fungus. They're gonna have to build her a robot body that looks exactly the same as her old body, mm, with all the same features as well. Yeah, just you know, because Escanor, you know. Exactly. But anyway, yeah, that was this week's episode. We're going off on a random a tangent, tangent about robots and stuff. Yeah. Thank you for Are watching. Are they real? Are they people? Who knows? Robots? Find Find out. Find out on the next exciting episode of Dragon Ball Z. I haven't actually seen that. I haven't seen that. Oh, I was going to make that at the end. Bye. Oh, see ya.